Hello everybody, my name is Jed Wallace and I'm a staff technologist at Cohesity. Today I'm going to show you how you can use Instant Mash Restore to instantly recover your data and applications quickly to get your organization back up and running again. So let's dive in. Here you can see I've logged into Helios Global Dashboard. This is our single management UI, which allows us to perform multiple operations with integrated solutions for data protection, security, data mobility, data access, and data insights all from one convenient location. So from the app selector, I'm gonna go ahead and click on cluster manager. And from here, you, you can see a drop down with the, the various managed clusters that we do have here. But for today, I'm gonna go ahead and click on Cohesity Demo Cluster. Now I'm gonna go and navigate to data protection, then recoveries. And then next, we're gonna go ahead and click on recover and then from this drop down, we're going to select virtual machines and then VMs because today we're going to work on strictly restoring virtual machines. Here you could see that we have the, the search, which we can look for VMs or protection groups that we want to restore by entering either the name of the VM or protection group name or using a wildcard. Uh, you can also search for other specific workloads like an application or a web workload that can contain hundreds, if not thousands of machines, which can definitely speed up recovery. So next I'm going to click into the search. In this example, we're going to be searching for VMs with IMR and the data protection job name. So I'm going to go ahead and type IMR and hit enter. So from the list of search results, we're going to select the protection group for the snapshots we would like to recover. And so I'm going to click default IMR Windows app. This is the uh, protection group that we're going to be restoring today. So next, I'm going to go ahead and click on recover options. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to restore this to a new location. And so we need to go ahead and fill out the register source for today. It's going to be our dim VCSA01, the drop down for our resource pool, our data store, that we want to recover to, which is our storage. And we're going to go ahead and pick this one. And then we're going to have the folder that we want to actually recover this to. So I'm going to go ahead and, and I'm going to select our restore folder. And before I click recover, I want to mention that Cohesity file system, which is designed with immutable backup snapshots, uh, prevents modification or deletion of your data. Um, we actually call this feature data lock and it's set on the uh, policy for the protection job. So let's go ahead and click recover. So to view the progress of the restores, we can monitor the progress from either Cohesity, where you can see right here the uh, actual status, or we can actually swap over to the vSphere administration console, which I already have. Uh, logged in and we can actually see where the uh, restore is actually going to occur. So in the vSphere administration console, we can see all the selected VMs become instantly available in the target location. So data and VMs will automatically be moved to the destination data store, again storage, in the background when, when this is complete. So as you can see, Instant Mash Restore allows you to quickly recover and instantly access your data and workloads at scale with no, virtually no waiting. This is a huge advantage over traditional restore methods, which rely on copying data from point B back to point A before you can even see the data, which literally can take days or weeks to complete. So by utilizing Instant Mash Restore, you can get back to business right away without having to wait on timely restores. So thanks for watching and have a great day.